Baca and the Skeleton King, an unofficial Minecrafter's adventure by Jerome A.S.F., is a tale set within the Minecraft universe, following the adventurous Baca, a fur-covered character inspired by the author's online persona. The fast-paced story is infused with the game's elements, catering to the fans with an action-packed narrative that embodies the principles of courage, friendship, and the battle between good and evil. Baca, our furry protagonist, isn't your average character in the realm of Minecraft. Once a simple lumberjack enjoying a peaceful life, Baca is thrust into the role of a hero as dire circumstances call for his unique strengths and bravery. Unlike the typical player character, Baca has a distinguishing trait, a luscious coat of fur. This feature gives him an iconic look and plays a role in his interactions with the world around him. When the story unfurls, Baca's day-to-day -day routine is disrupted by the sudden appearance of the Skeleton King, a fearsome entity with dark powers and a malevolent agenda. The Skeleton King poses an existential threat to Baca's world, assembling an army of minions that include skeletons, zombies, creepers, and other hostile creatures found in the lore of Minecraft. It's not just Baca's home at stake, but the entirety of his blocky universe. Through a series of events, Baca stumbles upon the revelation that he is destined to confront the Skeleton King. This insight comes with the discovery of an ancient prophecy that alludes to a hero with a furry coat who is the only one capable of defeating the darkness plaguing their world. Realizing the weight of responsibility on his shoulders, Baca accepts his fate as the Chosen One. To prepare for the epic confrontation, Baca must embark on a quest to gather resources and allies. His journey is filled with challenges that test not only his combat skills, but also his problem-solving abilities and determination. True to the source material, this quest leads Baca through various biomes, each with its unique hazards and treasures. Throughout this journey, Baca must mine for valuable ores, craft equipment, and build structures in order to gain an advantage over the Skeleton King's forces. Along the way, Baca befriends a diverse cast of characters. These allies include fellow adventurers, wise mentors, and powerful warriors, each bringing their own set of skills to the table. By combining forces and working as a team, Baca's group is able to overcome obstacles that would have been insurmountable alone. One notable companion that Baca encounters is a mysterious character who becomes particularly crucial to the progression of the plot. This enigmatic ally is intimately linked with the magical aspects of the Minecraft world, providing insight and mystical support to Baca. Together, they unearth secrets about the Skeleton King's powers and the deeper magic at play in the conflict. Themes of trust and camaraderie are woven throughout the narrative, illustrating the importance of building relationships and leaning on others during tough times. Baca learns the value of uniting with his companions and the strengths derived from diverse talents and perspectives. Throughout these endeavors, Baca also discovers the power of his own inner strength and the role it plays in shaping his destiny. As Baca and his allies gather strength and learn about their enemy, the battle lines are drawn. The clash between Baca's forces and the Skeleton King's army is a high-stakes showdown that pushes our heroes to their limits. Minecraft's signature mechanics come to life during this confrontation, as strategies are informed by both the natural laws of the game and the creativity of the characters. The final battle is a testament to the strength forged through unity and perseverance. As Baca confronts the Skeleton King, he faces not only the physical might of his adversary, but also the psychological warfare that comes with facing a nemesis. The conflict culminates in a dramatic showdown that utilizes all of Baca's acquired skills, the power of his team, and the hard-won knowledge of the world around them. In the end, Baca's story is one of victory, but not without loss and sacrifice. The battle against the Skeleton King leaves scars on both the landscape and the characters who fought bravely. However, Baca's success serves as a beacon of hope to all those in his world, proving that even in the face of overwhelming darkness, light can prevail through courage, unity, and the indefatigable spirit of adventure. The book wraps up with Baca reflecting on his experiences, the friends he's made, and the challenges he's overcome. His role as a hero is solidified, but the understanding that his world will always need protecting is clear. 
Baca and his companions ensure they remain vigilant, ready to take on whatever new threats may come their way. In totality, Baca and the Skeleton King is a tale about overcoming adversity through bravery, companionship, and the wielding of one's innate talents. True to the spirit of Minecraft, it celebrates the game's emphasis on exploration, creativity, and community. It's an acknowledgement of the collective power of individuals united for a common goal and the recognition of heroes who rise from the most unassuming origins. You can listen to the full audiobook for free by following the URL in the description.